credit to Ohio State. Um, they were the way more physical team. Um, and I'm not complaining about refs. They were the more physical team uh, imposing their will on us, um, absolutely obliterating us on the backboard at the beginning of the game. And it set the tone um, for our guys. And we, we were not ready uh, for that physicality. So we've got to look ourselves in the mirror, um, players, coaches, myself, and figure out what we need to correct uh, and move on because that's what the Big Ten is all about. That's what everybody signed up for. It's good physical basketball. And um, Ohio State had it. We did not. That was the first kind of you know, test that some of the younger guys and newcomers had of what how physical the Big Ten would be. It's a lesson. Yeah, I mean, it's a lesson. That's what this league is all about. That's what the programs that are consistently at the top are all about. Um, you know, and it's uh, it's just very simple. If you're not going to bring it physically, you're not going to win this league. Did the quick turnaround from Friday to today have any kind of effect on your team? Play at 9 o'clock two nights ago. It is what it is. Um, there's not, not a whole lot we can do to control it. Um, you know, so you just, I don't know, it's not going to change the outcome. I say losing to Muhammad just the other day, when you were scouting them, did that make it more of a challenge to figure out what they were going to do? Not really. I mean, you know, they're, they're not complex. They're really, really good at what they do, and they've got a lot of good players. Um, you know, so injuries are an unfor unfortunate part of the game. Um, you know, obviously we're dealing without Eric Curry, and, uh, you know, so I, I thought that, uh, they're really good at just simple, good basketball. Did you like the shots that you were getting? You know, I don't know. I mean, I, I thought versus Boston College, I thought we missed a bunch of open looks. Uh, I'm not so sure that was the case tonight as much. Um, you know, I just think that's a big physical team, and we didn't handle it well. You mentioned Ohio State's just good at what they do. When you look at them, what is it specifically, and, and what makes them? Good? They're really, really physical, really physical. Um, you know, they're, they're they're tough and physical, and they impose it on you. And again, not not with fouling. I'm not I'm not complaining about the refs. I just think they they do a really really good job with little things of just being physical. Whether it's a screen, whether it's a block out, whether it's an offensive rebound. Uh, you, you talk about uh, Eric Curry's injury. Yeah. Freshman in there playing for him, and then obviously Cox uh, Stockton. You know, what, what's it going to take for you guys to overcome maybe their lack of physicality while Eric is still out? Just going to have to get better and learn from this. Um, like I said before, injuries are a part of the game, and uh, we're not going to make an excuse. So we just got to learn from it, get tougher and more physical. Coach, you've talked about you know some of the struggles you had tonight. What were some positives you saw? Things you think you can build on as you. I continue on with the season. Try to set me up. <laughs> no. I'm... I would say that nobody got hurt, and I would hope our flight's on time. That's about all I can give you for positives. You are going home, though, playing Nebraska. You know, it's a quality opponent. You have a 20 game schedule, so, you know, this is a, a league this year that, you know, it's a lot better than last season. A lot of chances, uh, obviously, to bounce back and, and get a quality one maybe get some confidence back. Yeah, we haven't been home. Um, you know what we're six and two. We played. We played two games home, six on the road. Um, you know, as as I was concerned with this game, just because, you know, you play Friday late, um, hard to do. So it's not ideal, but it is what it is. It was a cool opportunity to play um, in U.S. Bank, but now it's important for us to, from our fan standpoint, we need you. Um, you know, get a great crowd, um, show people what Williams Arena is all about, and then I get a I get a coach the crap out of these guys the next couple days to get them better because uh, that's not good enough. It doesn't matter where you're playing. Couple more programs. Obviously, the Big Ten did this last year with these early conference games. What do you make of that? I don't like them. Um, I don't like them at all. But and that's not the reason we lost. If we could have played in February, we'd have lost the way we played tonight. Uh, you know, it, it, it's not an easy solution. I would prefer just play them by Christmas, um, you know, and uh, do some more one-day preps, you know, but the leagues wanted to do that or not do that. Uh, so I think that's the reason why. But if you're going to go to 20 league games, um, I don't know how the ACC is doing it. Are they doing the same thing? I have no, no idea. Nobody knows. Um, but I know they're doing 20 games as well. So I don't love it. Uh, the three-point shooting, you know, game 
percentage wise, he's the only one who really hits the career team this year. When you want to get him for me, um, I mean, teams are obviously moving forward, trying to take him away and. and I don't think the three-point shooting was the problem. I mean, you know, we didn't shoot. I mean, obviously we didn't make any, but we didn't shoot a bunch of them. Like, you know, Boston College, we shot 30 of them and made five, where I do think we had some sense that it's not going in. Um, but, yeah, that's got to improve. You know, we got to be able to hit shots um, and then be able to go inside to out. You know, I've said before, I don't know if we're ever going to be a phenomenal shooting team. Um, you know, for Oklahoma State, we made shots, but that shouldn't matter. When you, if you want to win on the road in the Big Ten, you got to be physical. You've got to scratch and claw every single possession, uh, and we didn't do that. You know, so it's a great lesson for our guys. I mean, because going at Michigan State's not going to be easy. Going at Purdue and going at Indiana—that's what the Big Ten's all about. Um, you know, so we've got to we've got to reflect, learn, uh, get better from it. Still very very early, obviously. Uh, I'm sure they're tired. You know. To, to play as late as we did and then come back, obviously, takes a toll on you. Um, but that shouldn't matter. You're going to fight through it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.